There's a war on Parkinson's, and I'm a general in this operation. Who's with me? Yes, sir. Rick went through, he's had some tough times. He's never given up. Rick is always there to, I can do it, I can do it, I can do it. I don't know Rick well, and he doesn't know me well, but he's changed my life. At 49 years of age, uh, I had three surgeries and uh, still did not know what I had or what was bothering me. And finally, after consulting four different neurologists, one neurologist says, I think you have Parkinson's. As a physical therapist, I never really thought about bike riding as being a tool to uh, rehabilitate yourself. I met Rick Bogdan in a motorcycle shop three months ago. Uh, he told me he had Parkinson's disease. He was going to take a ride all the way to California. I pretty much become his hand to help him keep his bike in, in working order. And I think he's going to make it. The whole world could be ending, and he would just be riding his motorcycle with a smile on his face, thinking about what he's going to do tomorrow. I think if he thinks he can do it, more power to him. He knows himself better than anybody else. So if he's ready to do it, you know, I support him. His fitness plan is going to be all about stabilizing himself, doing exercises that'll stabilize his shoulder, his core, his lower body, things like that. If anybody can do it, Rick can do it. Mm. Super Rick. My Parkinson's is progressing. I can't lie to myself about that. Our wicks are all burning down. Mine's burning a little faster. Look forward to the next meeting where I'll talk to you again, hopefully when I get back from Montreal. You know, I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow, but here I am. Making a movie with you. <laughs> <laughs> Who'd ever thought? Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs>